All right, guys, welcome to the channel. Uh, different day, different flannel. That's how we do around here. Um, today we're gonna talk about the Indy again. Uh, we're gonna do a little bit of under the hood action. Uh, just lift the top, see what she's got underneath. So um, to unstrap this beast, you gotta take off the two tie downs, one on each side. And then you lift it up to reveal the monster. So you notice here that we're missing a air filter for the air box. That's a mod that I forgot to mention. Um, who needs a filter? What do you want? You want max air flow going through that box so you get max horsepower. Like you saw in the last video. Or maybe, the, maybe that was the video that this is in. I don't know. I'm not very good at editing and such. I have someone else do it. But uh, yeah, you got a... Uh, a lot of things here you gotta look for. Like, is the exhaust big enough? She'll do for now. I mean, there's plenty of room for upgrade here. You know, you got about like four inches there to, for extra room. There's plenty of room up here for more. You know, honestly, a dual exhaust would be pretty dope. Um, yeah, you got you got your oil here. Um, less the better. You know, saves on weight. Um, two belts. Because when you're an indie guy, you kind of rip it until you break it. And then you just replace it and then you rip it. And then you're fine looking underneath the hood you got a minimal foam insulation less better for weight i mean you really can tell the difference when you rip off about half that weight i mean that oh <laughs> all right well that's fine it's pretty brittle that means it runs good normally look at that it's like candy